Hey all, Dominic here again. Welcome to another video. I hope you're all okay today and I hope you're all having a nice weekend so far. So today's video is going to be something um, Alex Francis related. And I know I've not done any Alex Francis related videos in quite some time. But this is one I want to sort of talk about and share my thoughts on. So, I do. so <laughs> today... I'm going to be talking about if I ever got the chance to make an Alex Francis film, what would I do? <laughs> now, the reason why I want to sort of talk about this is due to the fact that when I made my videos last year talking about the Alex Francis film, um, it somewhat made me think about if I ever got the chance to make an Alex Francis film, what would I do? <laughs> you know what I mean? And when I made those videos last year, obviously I was doing it, it obviously I was sort of parodying uh, around the time when people hated the first trailer of the Sonic the Hedgehog film. And I thought, instead of <coughs> Alex, uh, instead of the Alex Francis film being bashed um, with the first trailer, why not do the opposite? So instead of everyone hating on it, everyone loved the Alex Francis film trailer and they were looking forward to it. And with that, I thought it'd be interesting to, you know, do a you know a good amount of videos where Alex hates on it. It gets in touch with the company, and he just doesn't want to see this film. So he doesn't. So around that time, I kept thinking. I thought, well, if I ever got the chance to make an Alex Francis film, what would I do? And I think I'd do all sorts of different things. Now it's something I haven't really thought about, like the plot line or whatever. But little things that made me think, like what would I do? And I think I would. I'd, I'd sort of do a bit of like a sci-fi film. I would do where me and Alex go on on an adventure so we do uh, a bit like a time traveling thing something like <laughs> sounds like something from like uh, like Doctor Who or um, Bill and Ted's um, excellent adventure whatever you call it um, but it'd be more geeky <laughs> so <laughs> yeah people will say it's like a parody of Bill and Ted you know what I mean we would call it Dom and Alex or whatever but <laughs> it'd be um good to do something like that and I think maybe I would sort of make Alex you know want to be on his own or that you know he's, he's sort of sick and tired of life it's like I'm sick of modern day life I want to go back in the past and you know do what makes me happy and all this sort of stuff um, or even do some sort of alternative where maybe some incident happens and you know unfortunate life changes it's good for Alex, but it makes the world a lot worse than it usually is. And that's what I was going to somewhat do. Because one idea that I had was Alex wants to go back in the past and see his family. So see his parents again. Because it's been over 15 years since he last saw them. And he misses them so much. He really, really does. So what ends up happening, he wants to go back and prevent them from dying from um dying in the car crash they were in so he ends up preventing it so they don't end up uh, being killed in the car crash and they survive which makes alex happy but it makes my, my obviously it makes myself a bit worrisome because they were supposed to die and thinking what's going to happen in the world now <laughs> now that alex's parents are alive and they did not die um what is the alternative world going to look like you know what I mean? And just little things like that, that would be interesting. Um, I was even thinking about maybe there was like a clone of Alex <laughs> that maybe there was a different timeline or maybe a different life that he that he never knew about or <clears throat> something just quirky like that. You know what I mean? Um, which that'd be interesting that like having uh, like 15 different versions of Alex Francis. <laughs> Imagine that. Oh, my God. <laughs> How would I react in that? You know, you got me, one Dominic Trofa, and 15 Alex Francis, <laughs> Alex Francis's, you know what I mean? That'd be absolutely funny. But it'd be interesting to see what I'd do, you know what I mean? Like, just <laughs> some crazy thing, uh, and just all sorts, you know what I mean? And I think it might be ideas that I want to sort of do in the audio stories that I plan to do. Because uh, I know I did plan, you know, to make another one quite some time ago. And I haven't ignored that. So I haven't. It's just that I focus on other ideas and I've just been putting different ideas, you know, behind and stuff. And, you know, that's just, you know, how it is. 
but I still want to definitely get, you know, I definitely plan to do more audio stories. I really, really do. Because um, I know some people might think, oh, <coughs> sorry about that. Because some people might think I'm trying to ignore them, but I'm not. Um, it's just that I've been thinking about different ideas and that's just how it is, you know what I mean? But it would be interesting and pretty cool to see something like that if I did eventually someday make an Alex Francis film. Um, I know it's not going to be like a full-on world blockbuster <laughs> type thing at a cinema, but it would be pretty cool to see that, you know what I mean? Like, to think, you know, see my own work and stuff. And if I ever did make one and it was, you know, success, it'd be nice. If, if it wasn't a success but it was like a cult following, you know, I'd, I'd still be happy about that. I'm like... My work is on the cinema, you know what I mean? That's just how it is. But, you know what I mean? It'd be pretty cool to do that, and yeah. Um, so, yeah, <laughs> just little things and stuff. But, yeah, if, if I ever did get the chance to make an Alex Francis film, it would be awesome, you know what I mean? It really, really would. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to talk about it and share my <coughs> things, views and stuff, because I find it interesting. I like to do different things on this channel, as we all know and stuff. So, yeah. So I just want to say uh, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. hope you found it interesting and fascinating in its own way. And yes, <laughs> sorry. And and yeah, so I just want to say thanks for watching all. Enjoy the rest of your weekend and I'll be back on Tuesday. So thanks for watching all. See you all later. Bye.